Hi everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to design realistic banner in Photoshop. First I will create a document 2000 by 2000 and resolution will be 300 and this color mode will be RGB. I am going to create a rectangle I will keep this fill color white and rename this background I am going to group this one by pressing control G and rename this one background now I will lock this background. I will use this image for the banner. I will give the PSD file in the description box, then you can download it for free. I'm going to increase the size of the image. Now I will create a rectangle I will change this color to light blue this color code is 2686B5. Now I am going to decrease the opacity of this fill color. That's why I am going here. Now I will decrease the opacity of this color. I will keep 60. Yeah, that's fine. Now I will create another rectangle in the bottom. I'll keep this color. This color code is zero B four five seven five. Now I will create another rectangle here. I will keep this rectangle under this whole layer. Now I will change the color of this rectangle. I will keep the light yellow. Now I will draw a rounded rectangle. This radius I keep. 20 pixels. I will keep this radius 20 pixels. Now I am going to copy this one by pressing Alt Shift key. Here I will use the image. First, I will use this one. Now I am going to increase the size of this image. That's why I am pressing Ctrl T for transfer. Now I will keep this rectangle over under this image. Now I am right now I will 
click and right click here on the image then create clip mask again i will do the same thing for this image i will now i'm going to create click control tree for transform now increase the size of the image now i will keep this rounded rectangle under this image now now i am going to click on the image then press click and mask okay now i will group this all first i am clicking here then shift key then i am going to group all this by pressing ctrl g and i am going to rename this one to design now i will lock this one I will use lemon milk font. I will keep this on color white. I am going to increase the size of the font. going to copy this one by pressing all shift key. I'm going to rename this for same. Now I will increase the size of this. Again I will copy this one by pressing all shift key and rename this. I'm going to center this all. Just I'm uh, selecting control for each. Now I align it. And I'm going to copy this one. I'm going to rename this logo. I will decrease the size of it. Now here I will use robot font. Now I will draw a ellipse by pressing Alt Shift key. I'm going to copy this one. I will decrease the size of this image. I will keep 80. And I'm going to rename this one. I am going to copy this one by pressing all shift key. 
again I am going to copy this one back to the hard shift key. I am going to copy this one. I'm going to copy this number setting all sheet. I will rename this one. I'm going to group this all. By pressing Ctrl G, now I'm going to remove this text. Now I'm going to unlock this all. Now I'll create another document. 2000 by 2000. Here I will use this image now i'm going to now i'm going to here edit every edit option that pre transform i'm going to increase the size of this image now i will draw a rectangle of this I will keep this color, this color from code is 2686D5. Now I will re reduce this fill color opacity. I will keep this 70. Now I am going to copy this one. That's the first I will select this all. That's why I will just control it, select all. And I'm going to press Ctrl Shift C for copy. I'll paste it for Ctrl B. Now I'm going to decrease the size of this image. That's why I'm pressing Ctrl T for transform. Now I'm going to align it in the center. Now I will apply drop shadow. In the image, I keep distance 15 and spread will be 8 and size 170. This tape will be 80 and land notice 150. 
this is for today's tutorial i hope you guys like it if you like this tutorial don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you for watching